Hi everyone, welcome to our spin-off channel, Pixie Room Madness. Now I did promise you that um, I'd show you what diet I've been on. Um, I have been on the 35 day diet chef diet. Um, I started that the day after Boxing Day and I think I'm about maybe three weeks in. And in three weeks I have lost, um, well I was 10, 11 when I, sorry, I was 11, 11 when I started and now I'm 10, 12. So nearly a stone, I suppose, nearly a stone in three weeks. It's made a massive difference to um, my clothes. As you know, Nick and I are going off to Australia to do a bit of work but in that time I'm probably also going to need to wear a bikini. So, you know, that's like, the, those words put the fear into you, don't they? I mean, when someone says that to you, you think, well, I'm either not going to wear a bikini or, or I'm going to have to lose some weight to get into one. And it's a new year, so I thought, and there's been a lot of changes in my life, which I'm not going to go into, but, um, you know, it's been a trying time. So um, I decided to just try this diet. I saw it advertised, I thought, that looks ridiculous. And then I thought, I wonder if it works. So I had a look at it and then I just bought it, as you do. Um, so I'll tell you how it works. You get your meals for the month. It all comes in three boxes. And you only eat what you are given. Everything is calorie counted for you. So you don't have to worry about portions, which is brilliant for me because I'm very bad at portions. I'll eat healthy stuff, but I'll eat loads of it. And that's my problem. Um, so this is brilliant because you know if you stick to this, you will lose weight. So every day you have breakfast, um, breakfast comes for you. I haven't actually got that here to show you. And then lunch, you pick what meals you want out off the website. There's a ton of different meals. Lunch, you have soup. So it's perfect in the winter. I don't know if I'd be able to do this diet in the summer because I don't really like soup in the summer, but it's brilliant for now. So they've got all these different soups. Um, I'm, a, I'm a mushroom soup addict. I have a problem with mushrooms, I am really addicted to them. Um, so I've got tons of mushroom soup. The other one that I really love is sweet potato and coconut. That is a really nice soup. The tomato soup is lovely. Minestrone is great. I mean, it's really nice tasting stuff. So you can have your soup for lunch and a slice of bread, but don't put butter on it because that's kind of def defeating the purpose. And then um, you have snacks. You have one snack a day. There's big bags of popcorn or there's like packs of biscuits. Uh, I tend to go for the popcorn because I don't really have much of a sweet tooth. Um, and then for dinner, your dinner comes, I mean it's like, it is like space packed food. I was a bit freaked out when I first saw it. Anyway, you, this, it comes like this and what you need to do is add your vegetables to it. So every evening I'll have half a pack of French beans, um, I might eat a whole pack of mushrooms because I do have a problem with mushrooms as I said before, um, bags of vegetables, tomatoes. I'm eating a lot more healthy stuff than I did before. I'm definitely getting my five a day now, which, which I can't say that I always used to. Um, so I have noticed a difference in my energy levels as well. But that, I mean, that could be down to healthy eating and it could also be down to losing weight and it could also be down to the fact that I've been going to the gym. But, you know, I do YouTube, I work and I've got two kids, so I get to the gym once a week. Um, I do run on the treadmill for 20 minutes when I'm there, which is amazing for me because I'm not the kind of person that can even run for a bus, so um, I am doing quite well. And this diet, I I don't know if it's psychological or not, but I don't feel hungry. I would stuff myself in the evening, I stuff myself with vegetables. You do need to like healthy stuff, otherwise you're going to be hungry. I mean, if, you, if you're one of those people that just lives on stodgy food, then this probably isn't a diet for you. But if but if you are someone that likes to eat healthy food but just struggles with portions and calories, then this could be perfect for you. It's been amazing for me. I mean, Mum and Mum and Nick have been watching me do it and they haven't been able to believe how quickly I've lost weight on this. So they, um, they've both started. I think Nick started this week. Mum started this week too. Um, so yeah, I totally recommend it. So that is Diet Chef and it... Also online you have, there's uh, where you log into your diet chef or your details so you can change your meals because the first time you order all these meals you don't know if you're going to like them or not so you might try one, like I don't really like the veggie chilli because I don't like loads and loads of kidney beans. I knew that there would be kidney beans in it but I ordered it anyway because that was just stupid so 
so next month I can take all those off and replace them with different meals, which is great. But when you log in, there's also this tool, um, like a weigh-in, a virtual weigh-in. So you weigh yourself and it plots out a graph of how much you've lost and also you put in the weight that you want to be. So it tells you roughly when it, when it expects you to reach your target weight. So ideally, I'd like to be 10.5 stone. Now, I've never been 10.5 stone. What is that in kilos? Because I know a lot of other countries don't do stone. I think... Um, I don't know what it is in kilos. Maybe it's like 64 kilos or something. I am guessing. I tell you what, I'll, I'll, I'll put a little flash bar up of how many kilos it is. How much I am now and how much I want to be. So, ideally I want to be 10.5 stone. Um, I haven't been 10.5 stone since I was about 19. Bear in mind I'm 5 foot 10 as well. So, for me... That's that's quite a good weight. I mean, that is a slim weight for me. Um, obviously, if you're five foot two, then then ten and a half stone is is maybe overweight. So anyway, um, yeah, I totally recommend this diet. It's been brilliant for me. It's the kind of thing that I would be able to do. Um, it's the kind of thing that I'll be able to pick up like for a month on here and there but also you know it's been really nice to eat so many vegetables and to cut out so many carbs as well I mean there are carbs in, in a lot of these meals I mean this is mushroom stroganoff there's um, there's macaroni cheese there's lasagna there's lots and lots of carbs in these but I mean that's a lot less carbs than I normally eat because I am carb heavy I love pasta I love potatoes I'll, and I'll eat them all together you know, I mean, really, the carbs are my killer. I'm not, I don't really have much of a sweet tooth. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it has been good. And Diet Chef you can get from Diet Chef online. I think that's dietchef.com. And if you... Also, QVC are selling it at the moment. QVC are doing a 20-day diet. Um, and it's... I can't remember how much it is, but it's not a bad price for 20 days. Um, I did the 35 day diet um, because you do you, you get the 28 days if you go onto the diet chef website which is what I did you get 28 days plus an extra week free so it cost me 190 pounds um, but I got I got an extra week three free so that's 35 35 days worth of food um, for 190 pounds but if you think about it you're not going to buy takeaways you're not going to buy alcohol all you need to do is buy vegetables um, to accompany your food. Other than that, it's only £190 a month, which sounds like a lot of money, but it isn't when you take out all the other stuff that you spend money on. Um, well, I do anyway, like wine, for example. I don't know, I must spend, I reckon I spend at least 30 quid a month on wine, possibly more. And also going out for meals. I'm not going out for meals at the moment, which is good because it saves me money, and um, yeah. If anyone is interested in doing the Diet Chef diet, um, I have a discount code that gives you £10 off. So instead of it costing you £190, you'd get the 35-day diet for £180. Um, I'll put the code, I'll put the discount code in the description box thingy. Um, and it also means that I get a £10 Marks and Spencer's voucher if you um, if you do get it through there. Which would be great. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. I mean I I'm really, this has been the easiest diet I've ever been on. I've been on Weight Watchers before. I found Weight Watchers very easy the first time I did it. The first time I did Weight Watchers, it was a breeze. And then I went on it and came off it and went on it and fell off the wagon maybe five separate times since then. And I've never, ever lost the weight like I did the first time. I don't know if it will be the same with this. I don't know. But I doubt it. As long as you stick to what you're given to eat, plus vegetables and fruit, and a bit of milk, um, then it's kind of foolproof. Anyway, that's that. I hope that's been useful. And uh, as I said, I'll put the links and the discount code in the description box. And I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.